Hi again, and welcome back to Poetry Passages. So I'm here again in front of the home of Donald Hall in Wilmot, New Hampshire. And Donald Hall lived here with his wife, Jane Kenyon, who was a fine poet in her own right. So I figured since we're here, let's read a little Jane Kenyon. And uh, this one is called The Blue Bowl, and it comes out of her collected poems. So here we go. The Blue Bowl by Jane Kenyon. Like primitives, we buried the cat with his bowl. Barehanded, we scraped sand and gravel back into the hole. It fell with a hiss and thud on his side, on his long red fur, the white feathers that grew between his toes and his long, not to say aquiline, nose. We stood and brushed each other off. There are sorrows much keener than these. Silent the rest of the day, we worked, ate, stared, and slept. It stormed all night, and now it clears, and a robin burbles from a dripping bush, like the neighbor who means well, but always says the wrong thing. So that is The Blue Bowl by Jane Kenyon. And despite the fact that both Donald Hall and Jane Kenyon wrote a lot about nature and the and the and reveled in the silence of nature, um, they actually lived on a pretty busy little road, and it's kind of hard to slip poetry in between the the sounds of speeding cars and trucks. But um, hope hopefully we did it. And thanks for watching, and and we'll catch you next time right here on Poetry Passages. Bye.